Hi, I'm Jean-Christophe Cimetière, Senior Technical Evangelist at Microsoft, and today I want to talk about uh, document interoperability, introducing a project that Microsoft is sponsoring. It's called the OpenXML Document Viewer, which uh, simply translates OpenXML text documents, so the, the docx files, to HTML. The goal here is really to create tools and guidance showing how a document created using the OpenXML format can be translated into HTML. So let's take a look at the translator. From a very high level architecture design point of view, the translator has a core translator engine with, which does uh, the main part of the job. It basically translates the XML, which is in the OpenXML document, to HTML using XSLT techniques. Uh, then the project will also include two entry points that will enable you to use the core engine either through a browser add-in or through a, a typical command line interface. So now I'm going to show you a demo with the translator in, in action. So keep in mind that this version is not yet feature complete. And uh, what I'm going to show is just yet another example on how you can use uh, the translation engine. All right, so for the purpose of the demonstration, we have embedded the OpenXML to HTML translation engine into a simple web-based application. So let's take a look at the application. The translation engine basically is this C sharp code and this uh, XSLT file. The combination of the two enables the translation from uh, OpenXML to HTML. So the next thing in this application is a simple web form, which we have here. In this web form, what are we going to do? We are going just to uh, select a file we want to convert and then upload and translate. So let's see how it works. So now I have my web form running. I'm going to upload and translate a document. But before I do that, let me show you the sample document we're going to use. So for the demo, we have prepared this document, which uh, is created with uh, Office Word 2007 and includes uh, a lot of different uh, formatting, different fonts, uh, tables, lists, and also uh, a table of content. We have included some images in this document, although the current release of the translator doesn't process the images, but it will in, uh, in more advanced releases. So let's see how it works. I'm just going to upload my document. Here we go, this one, and click Upload and Translate. And then the engine processes the OpenXML file, and here we go, creates the HTML. So as you can see, the formatting is very well preserved, the font, the colors, the tables, the list, uh, the paragraph, and also the links from the table of content are still uh, uh, are working. So, and the images are not processed, but it's going to, to work in a future release. And of course, I just want to very quickly show, show it to you working in Firefox because you will have the exact same experience. Let's see. Just want to show you that the HTML created is uh, standard HTML. With that, I really want to thank you for your attention. And uh, if you want more information, please go to the project uh, website, which is at uh, cutplex.com slash uh, openxml viewer, and you'll be able to download the source code and uh, test it for yourself.